Alright guys, welcome back to the channel where today we have the latest tech preview for Virtual Basement's The Wrestling Code. This new preview is the fourth instalment in the tech preview series, with this new entry showcasing some of the new systems that the team have been working on, which include the addition of both fat and muscle simulation. I'll let the preview play through, but make sure to stick around till the end for a Marvel-esque post credit scene, as well as additional details and new roster confirmations. So that's a new preview for The Wrestling Code, along with the official reveal of Scott Steiner and YouTube star Grimm's Toy Show. Reflecting on the footage, this is by far the most impressive teaser that we've seen, as the visuals in the trailer aren't just on par with that of WWE, but you might even argue that they surpass it, especially when it comes to Steiner, as this is one of the most detailed models we've ever seen. Taking a closer look at the model, this version of Steiner is based on his time in WCW, with the developer noting that this is one of the leaner versions of Steiner, with later versions said to be even bigger. Now, aside from the visuals, one of the most impressive elements shown is the movement of Steiner's chainmail, as whilst it does look like it's placed a little bit too high, the fact that we see it moving realistically with the character without clipping through it is extremely impressive, especially when we see Steiner doing push-ups, as the movement here looks incredibly realistic. As for the arena, this is obviously based around Scott Steiner, as the entranceway features giant artwork of Scott spray-painted on the left, whilst the right side features Steiner's infamous Steiner math breaking down his chance of winning. Alongside the entranceway, which features guardrails and a seating area, additional shots show off more of the area, which can be seen to feature a gym consisting of punching bags and weightlifting equipment. The teaser featured at the end of the video also teases the inclusion of Scott's brother Rick, therefore it's possible that the gym may be a home arena for both stars, with the artwork of Rick Steiner potentially featured on the opposite side. So that's the models and the arena, but what about the features listed at the beginning of the video? Well, in terms of new features, some of the new systems shown off include the addition of a muscle simulation system, which sees Steiner's muscles increase as he flexes, as the developer pointed out that his biceps can be seen to grow when he bends his arm, mimicking the muscle movement that you see when flexing your own arm. Also implemented is the addition of a new fat simulation system, as switching over at the footage of Grimm, if you take a look at his chest area, then you can actually see the fat bouncing up and down with the movement. For a small developer, this level of detail is something that you don't generally see, which is another indicator of just how the team are really pushing the boundaries of what fans can expect. 
Overall, whilst the preview does look impressive given the graphics, it's not without its flaws as some of the mocap animations do look a little bit off, especially when it comes to Steiner's arms as the placement looks a little bit too low and close to the chest with the size of the arms also somewhat small in comparison to the torso, but given that this is still just alpha footage there is plenty of time to address that. As for Grimm, while Steiner's model is instantly recognisable, Grimm's model doesn't look like it's on the same level as I feel the face still needs some work. There also appears to be an issue with the head moving away from the body as there's various points during the animation where you see a gap appear between the neck and the torso. As I mentioned earlier though, this is still just alpha footage as there is a long way to go before the game is complete, therefore issues like this, as long as there is now, then this should be addressed in the future. Moving on and alongside the tech preview, Virtual Basement also announced two stars who will be joining the roster, the first of which is former ECW and WWE star Jazz who most recently appeared in Impact where she took on the role of Manjin Jordan Grace and Rachel Ellering. The second star to be announced was Angelina Love who is most commonly known for her time in Impact where she appeared as part of the beautiful people tag team alongside Velvet Sky. With Velvet Sky already announced for the game, Angelina Love's announcement means players will soon be able to reunite the pair in the wrestling code. Also announced for the game, we have three more members of former ECW stable, the FBI, as Big Sal, Johnny the Bull Stamboli and Chuck Palumbo become the latest three members of the group to be announced, joining Little Guido and Big Sal who were announced previously. Alongside the new roster announcements, Virtual Basement also revealed the first look at Kurt Angle's model as the team shared these new images showing off an early version of Kurt's model. Unlike the models that are featured in the WWE 2K series which are created using 3D scans, Angle's model was sculpted by hand which makes it even more impressive given the likeness. As for the attire, the singlet that's featured here is one that Kurt used during his time in Impact Wrestling, however it's expected that we'll see multiple attires included for the final game. Along with these announcements, Virtual Basement also teased another star to have signed on as they shared this tweet which reads turn it up along with emojis for a pair of sunglasses and a worm which would appear to hint at the signing of former WWE star Scotty 2 Hottie. So that's the latest roundup of news for the wrestling code, but let me know what you make of the news and the new footage in the comments, and if you want to stay up to date with all the latest news on the game, please do hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that you don't miss out on future videos. Until next time though, thank you so much for watching, have yourself an awesome day, and I'll catch you later.